so I thought I would just go ahead and update you guys on kind of some stuff that's going on right now. Um, you're going to hear Mila in the background. Jason is really quickly moving our cars out of the driveway because we have mulch being delivered today. Um, so that's kind of that. Mila just sits here, so it's not that big of a deal. But um, anyway, so today I'm going to be working on audit requests for our external auditors. So if you guys are new to accounting, you're not super familiar with accounting or anything like that, then um, I just quickly wanted to kind of go over what that means and what that looks like. So basically, um, a lot of companies, usually more public companies, have to be audited by an external auditing firm or whatever it may be. So we have um, auditors that come in like interim, which is usually around like September. And then we also have people that come in or the same people come in again in like April or so. So right now we are preparing for our 2019 annual review or annual audit. Um, and so some of the stuff that I have to put together today really relates to like tax and pension stuff. So I have to provide support for the tax payments that we made throughout the year. I have to um, send in our like pension census stuff, our pension discount rate stuff, um, just all of that like really fun stuff that goes along with pension and taxes. So that's what I'm working on today. I also have to get a spreadsheet ready for 2020. So there's a spreadsheet that I do and I use throughout the year every quarter, but there's a lot of rates that change. There's a lot of like allocations that change. And so I have to update that for the next year. Um, and so we're going to be closing first quarter in April. So I'll need to set that up. Um, <laughs> Mila. So that's what I'm going to do um, today. But those two things will probably take up the majority of my day. And so that's kind of what I'm going to be working on. I did show you guys. <laughs> I did show you guys my um, planner and how I set it up. I am currently using the Erin Condren um, academic planner and that seems to be working out really nicely. Um, I really like that like on one side I can put what's going on that day. So like my meetings or like if I'm working from home and then the other side I can do like my to do's D today. I have like that main section in the, in between, um, with like all of the auto requests that I need to do. So I'm kind of checking it off or like marking it off as I'm doing it, which is really nice. Um, but that's kind of a little update on what I'm going to be doing today. Again, I can't show you a ton because it's a lot of like confidential data and especially like the pension stuff. That is like, I think only a few people actually get to see it. Mila thinks that's funny. Um, only a few people actually get to see it. So um, anyway, that's kind of that. This is my second week back um, from maternity leave. And so far, everything has been going pretty well. Um, compared to last time that I was on maternity leave, it seems like there's a lot less um, to do. Just it seems like while I was gone, some more stuff was covered, which is really nice because it's a little crazy when you get back and you all of a sudden you have like a crap ton of stuff to do. Um, so, so far I feel like we're doing pretty well. Today kind of what's going to go on is I normally work from 6.30 to 2.45. We have flexible schedules, so that's kind of what I'll do. Throughout the day, I like to take breaks, so I'll take a like 10 minute break where me and Macy will go and take a walk around the block and then I'll take a lunch break. All of us will eat, so I'll eat, Jason will eat, Macy will eat, um, Mila eats throughout the day. She has like five lunches. Um, so we'll do that and then in the afternoon I will also um, take another walk with Macy. And it's nice because again, I'm working from home because of everything that's going on right now. So Macy is home, Mila's home, Jason's a stay at home dad, so obviously he's here. But um, it's a lot having two kids here. So I'm trying to like break up the day as much as possible and get Macy out of the house for a little bit and the walk is definitely nice. It's also something that I normally would do even if I was in the office. I try and get up because I'm sitting all day and it's just not that great for you to be sitting all day and not getting any exercise. So that's what's gonna happen. Today I will be logging off exactly at 2.45 because Jason again has mulch that's coming and he needs to like go and lay that out and stuff so we can put the cars back in the um, garage and all of that. So that's kind of the plan for today. I'll keep you guys updated on what's going on um, and what I'm getting accomplished and all of that. I'll probably bring you along with my walk with Macy and all of that. So, and Mila is hanging out. Hi Mila. Are you hanging out with me? You are still like, I don't know what this. Bless you. Bless you. 
All right guys, so it's about 11.30 right now and I'm about to just log off and start my lunch break. But before I do that, I wanted to quickly just kind of update you guys about what I've done so far today. So I talked about the fact that we had some audit requests. Um, the requests that I had this morning were just relating to tax and pension stuff. So now, um, like a few, maybe an hour ago or so, my boss sent over another list um, of audit requests that actually relate to our um, contracts. So what I'll have to do the rest of today and then some of tomorrow is pull together um, the reports that came in and then just prove that we settled it. If we do not have proof that we settled it, it's still outstanding, then we'll have to um, let them know that and then the auditors will put together confirmations to send out to the other companies. So I'll be working on that for the rest of today. I also got an email from my boss asking about um, job description stuff. So I think later today we may have like a Skype meeting and just go over my job description and if, er if there's anything else that we need to add, which I do have like three, three or four things that I think they may add to my job description. I think they do this every couple of years, but it's been a while and I've acquired quite a bit of new um, duties since then. So I'm guessing they'll probably add a few. Um, we did have our weekly accounting meeting at 1030 and we kind of go off and on whether like we're actually going to have it or not. This time we actually did and they talked about the fact that Trump kind of extended the stay at home order until April 30th and my boss's boss like the CFO of our company basically said that it's safe to assume that we will be working from home until April 30th which is very interesting because like I mentioned earlier we start closing the first quarter in April um, April 30th like and even I guess I would say like the end of April and then like the beginning of May is crazy for us um, just because first quarter there's a lot of new changes and I personally have to print out a lot of stuff I have to print all of our reports when I start doing foreign currency stuff that's at the end of April I'll need a printer um, so it's gonna be interesting but that's kind of the biggest thing that kind of went on just now um, me and Macy did not go on our walk because things just got kind of crazy um, right before my meeting is when the mulch was delivered I think I talked about that but Jason had mulch delivered today so I had to go out there with the kids just for like a second while Jason helped the guy like figure out where to put the mulch um, then I had a run in here for my meeting. So anyway, that's a little update of what's going on today. I think for the rest of the day, um, I'll have lunch. During my lunch, I need to wash bottles, um, mom life, right? Um, and then I need to work on, I think my job description is done. I'll just have to have a meeting with my boss about that. And then I'll just continue working on audit requests. So lots of auditing stuff today. Um, again, this is kind of typical, like, the end of March, beginning of April is kind of when we have the external auditors for our annual audit. Um, and it always kind of goes alongside when we're doing stuff to like prep for first quarter. So usually for us, I would say like the middle of January all the way, way into the middle of May is like crazy. Luckily for me, because of maternity leave, I missed a lot of that, but um, I'm getting kind of like the tail end. So anyway, I'll keep you guys updated with what's going on and show you a little bit of that. Um, but that's pretty much it all right guys so it is past three o'clock and I am logging off today but I wanted to just quickly talk a little bit about what happened for the rest of the day I have my little buddy Macy here and she's ready for me to go and play with her so I'm gonna do that in a second but um, I did just have a meeting with my boss I talked to you guys a little bit before about it um, I sat down with her and just kind of went over my job description to update it there were like three or four things that we had to add um, since we did it last time, and I believe we do it every like two years. So we updated that to reflect all the new stuff that I'm doing. Um, we talked a little bit about everything that's going on and the fact that we're probably gonna be working from home for a while. Um, I was able to finish all the audit requests that I got for tax and pension, so those are all done. And then tomorrow, all I'll be wor working on is getting like our contract audit request done. So exciting stuff but I'm going to ha I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here if you guys have any questions for me leave them down below and if you guys want to see other work from home videos and stuff like that let me know and I'll do that can you say bye bye, bye guys bye.